This package was prepared using an online shipping service. Now, I don't ship out very frequently, so typically what I do is I take my item to the post office or the UPS store, whatever's more convenient. I use their packaging, I use their tape, they put on the scale, and off it goes. Now, here I had to get my own packaging. I had to get packaging tape, because I usually use theirs. I had to weigh it, and in my case, I happen to have an accurate scale here, but not everybody has a scale of this grade to weigh it exactly. Um, and then I had to do the dance, plugging on all the numbers. I had to you know, measure the dimensions of the package. And then they give me a, uh, a PDF of the label. Well, they calculate which is the cheapest way to ship, and they give me a PDF of the label. So now, for me, the hard part was getting it to print because I'm constantly in the cycle of using these inkjet printers, and I don't like them uh, because they're unreliable, and they constantly run out of ink, and then when I have to reorder the ink, um, it takes a couple of days for the new cartridge to get there, etc. So print out the label, and so here we are with our package prepared via an online shipping service. So I just got back from sending out the package, and before I had to send it out, I asked them, well, how much would this cost me if I didn't have the prepaid label, and I just sent this out and paid at the counter? They put on the scale, punched in the particulars and said the, the number was $13.20. Uh, the, using the online service, I paid $7. So if you're willing to go through the headache of preparing the package uh, by yourself, um, it could save you almost 50% using the online service.